What is an electrical resistor? A resistor is a passive component in a circuit which provides resistance to the flow of current. There are many different types of resistors. These resistors vary in their construction, power dissipation, capacities and tolerance to various parameters such as temperature and light. The types of resistors include carbon composition resistor, thermistor, wire wound resistor, metal film resistor, carbon film resistor, variable resistor, resistor, light dependent resistor. Now I will explain each and every type of resistor hereby. Carbon composition resistor. A carbon composition resistor also known as a carbon resistor is a commonly used resistor. These resistors are low cost and are easy to construct. Carbon resistors are mainly made of carbon clay composition covered with a plastic case. The lead of the resistor is made of tinned copper. The main advantages of these resistors are they are readily available, low cost and they are very durable. These resistors are also available in a wide range of values from as low as 1 ohm to as high as 22 mega ohm. For these reasons carbon composition resistors are often included in many of the best Arduino starter kits. The main disadvantage of carbon composition resistor is that they are very temperature sensitive. The tolerance range in resistance of carbon composition resistor is of plus minus 5 to plus minus 20 percent. Although this is not a concern for, for the majority of electronic projects one would experiment with at home. This type of resistor has a tendency to produce some electric noise due to passage of electrical current from one carbon particle to another. Where low cost is the main criteria for designing a circuit rather than its perfect performance these resistors are normally used. Carbon resistors are provided with different colored bands on their cylindrical body. These color bands are code for the resistance value of resistor along with their tolerance range. Thermistor. The word thermistor means a thermal resistor. Its resistance value changes with a change in temperature. Most thermistors have a negative temperature coefficient which means its resistance will fall down when the temperature increases. However, positive temperature coefficient thermistors are also available whose resistance increases with an increase in temperature. These are normally made of semiconductor materials. A resistance up to a few mega ohm can be obtained from thermistors. They are used to detect small temperature changes. When there is a temperature change, however small, there will be a large change in the value of the resistance. Wire wound resistor. In wire wound resistor, a wire of magnin or constantin is wound around a cylinder of insulating material. The temperature coefficient of resistance of magnin and constantin is almost zero, so resistance variation with temperature of these resistance is negligible. The wound wire is covered with an insulating cover such as backed enamel. This cover of insulating heat resistible material resists the effect of ambient temperature variation. Different sizes and ratings of wire wound resistors can easily be achieved by using different lengths and diameter of the wire. These resistors are easily available from a wide range of rating. The range of resistance value varies from 1 ohm to 1 mega ohm. The typical tolerance limit of these resistors varies from 0.01% to 1%. They can be used for high power applications of 5 to 200 watt dissipation ratings. The cost of the resistor is much higher than the carbon composition resistors. Normally a wire wound resistor is used where a carbon composition resistor can not meet the purpose because of its limitations. The main disadvantage of the resistor is the inductance that arises because of its coil-like construction. At high frequency, the behavior of the circuit may be changed due to its reaction. This problem can be solved if one half of the wire is wound in one direction and another half in the opposite direction so that the inductance due to these two halves cancels each other. Hence, the net inductive effect of the resistor becomes nil. The non-inductive wire wound resistor is ideal for the high frequency circuit but it is costlier than an ordinary one. Metal film resistor and carbon film resistor. The resistor is constructed by means of deposition of thin film of a conductive material such as pure carbon or metal on an insulating core. The desired value of resistance of metal film resistor or carbon film resistor can easily be obtained by either trimming the layer of the thickness or by 
cutting helical grooves of suitable pitch along its length. Metallic contact cap is fitted at both ends of the resistor. The caps are in contact with the conductive film or helical grooves. The lead wire is welded to the end caps. Metal film resistors or carbon film resistors can be made up to a value of 10,000 mega ohm and the size of, the, of this type of resistor is much smaller than a wire bound resistor. Because of their constructional feature, these resistors are fully non-inductive. The accuracy level of metal film resistor can be of order plus minus 1% and they are suitable for high grade applications. Carbon film resistors give lower tolerance and smaller values of electrical resistance and those available with a metal film. However, the carbon film possesses a mildly negative temperature coefficient resistance which is very useful for certain electronic circuits. Variable resistor. The variable resistor means its resistance value can be adjusted similar to a potentiometer. There are a rotating shaft and a wiping contact. Basically, there is a resistive semicircular bar or coil and by wiping the contact, we change the effective length of the resistive element and hence the resistance gets changed. One example of such resistors is a rheostat. The variable resistor or rheostat can also be a linear sliding type where the sliding contact moves on the resistive element linearly for adjustment of the effective resistance of the resistor. Nonlinear resistor or variistor. They are also known as variistor. They are popular for having a nonlinear VI characteristics curve. That is, its resistance is not uniform and it doesn't obey Ohm's law. They are made of metals such as silicon carbides, zinc oxide. There are three types of variistors, silicon carbide disc type variistor, silicon carbide rod type variistor, zinc oxide type variistor. Light dependent resistor. A light dependent resistor or LDR will vary in resistance depending on the intensity of light falling on it. This is made of cadmium sulfide which contains a small number of electrons when it is illuminated when it is not illuminated. When a light ray falls on it, electrons get ejected and hence the conductivity of it increases. Hence, it offers low resistance when light falls on it and offers high resistance in the dark. So friends, hope you people learned something from this video. If you learned something from this video, please give a big thumbs up and also subscribe on my channel and press bell icon so you will get notifications for future videos. Thank you for watching.